right, we'll wave. We'll be back with that recipe when we get it. Let's go buy another um, bus sign and then head up to the mountains. Missing the beach here. I think there's a way this way. Beautiful crafted carving is something you feel very welcome. Plus one extra guest plus in the area. Thank you. That's so cute. Don't we have another monument we can like fix? There's one right there. I don't know if we fixed that one. And then we can do something over here, I'm assuming. Don't know what yet. But we can find out. Oh, we can fix this too. Hell yeah. A monument to capitalism reveals itself before you. It's very pretty. <laughs> what the hell? It's so funny. A monument to capitalism. They're not wrong. They're certainly not wrong. That's just a funny way of putting it. All right, into the snowy mountains. Ooh. Winterberry. It's a pretty big area. Jax. It's a pretty big area. Who the hell? here. There, we'll fix that up. Oh! That means we've almost gotten all our, um, things. There's one more we haven't gotten that we can bust stop to. And I wonder if it's just the beach down here.
I'm glad there's another area that you can collect um, wood from. Lots of trash. Lodger's tool. Um, yeah, I just want that trash. This is an interesting shaped place. No trash upstairs? Interesting. I'm loving picking up all this trash. Uh, we'll repair it, even though we won't really need it. This is what they mean when the each building will need uh, its own kitchen and dining area. All right, there's someone over here that we should talk to for this. Oh, another place. Is like a bath? Is he a dog? What is he? <gasps> Christmas trees. Uh, hey! Oh, the air suddenly feels a little warmer. Bro, hello? Out in the middle of icy nowhere, deep in the heart of Winterberry, resided Jax the Mastiff. Yeah, he's a dog. His gentle and warm approach seemed deliberate for a place this cold. For if anyone knew how to kindle a fire, it was probably Jax. He's so cool looking. He's adorable. <laughs> it's rare that I don't have to look downwards to speak to someone. Even rarer to not have to look up to a face one of your kind. Did you just compliment and snub me at the same time? No such thing. Neither or do any good to the mind. I will praise or condemn only deeds. Not things you had no hand in. It's okay, I don't like getting either. I don't know what to do with them. What does a young brown bear need from a frigid place like this? My name is Hank, and I'm putting together a group of remarkable friends to save the world. Hmm, are you? No, but now you might actually believe the second thing now. I'm rebuilding things throughout the valley and and bringing back humans because of a greedy shark. <laughs> oh, interesting. Why? What do you mean, why? Because the inflatable fish said so. <laughs> but why are you doing it? Because, well, because I like helping. So it's the kindness in your soul then. Yeah, I think. Oh, and I'm also looking for something uh, zesty. Well, Hank, that might be something I could help you with. But I like to see that group you're putting together first. And we can discuss aromics. Aromics? Aromatics afterwards? I can get started on building stuff. That sounds like a plan. And Hank, make sure that kindness eventually finds its way back. Okay, so what do you want me to do? Find a repair find to repair one of the ski cabins. Okay, we will do that. 
I'm gonna collect more wood because I know I'm damn well gonna need it. Oh, I wonder if we're gonna get that stuff now. open this yet. Oh, someone's shop? Oh, that's a lot of snow. I'm also looking out for chests. Everything is cold here, even the cold. I don't know what you are, but hi. I'm just gonna take your couch outside if that's okay. Is that a monument? Oh shit, we can um do it though. Old snow kitten. The old machine looks like it could reach anywhere once, and to think she used to roar through the valley. Two extra guests. Beneficial for the future. We're definitely gonna get the prospector gear here. I'm excited to unlock everything. I'm kind of sad that the game seems like it's nearing its closure though. Like on the cusp. Alright. Hey sharky friend. Hey Finn. What drives what drive why drive to paradise when you can fly? Automobile trade ins now available. Only applies to one way tickets or less. Hello, I think I'm freezing my tail off. We here at Pion Voyage are committed to offer only the utmost standard experience to our valuable customers, which is why this location will feature breakthrough advancements in the hospitality industry. Above freezing temperatures. Please return once a suitable venue has been established. Gotcha, buddy. I need to go- I'm actually gonna go get the lodger's tool so we can get that up and running too. Just real quick, sees. I wonder when we're gonna get a shirt. It's a kraken. I run down say sign me beautiful once more. It says hello there. Aw. I guess we'll do this side first. I did, sir. Yep. We got enough. Right. Oh, there's trash here. We just need to talk to Jax now. And we'll come back and fix it up. Jax, we did it. Mm, yes, 
Building stuff done. Impressive. Thanks. Hmm? Oh, hello. It's still me. Yes, it certainly is. Yes, well, as you know, I'm putting together a group of remarkable people to save the world. Yes. Right. And, you know, the world is a lot colder than they thought. Especially around these parts. It can certainly bristle the coat on your back. And I was wondering if this group of, you know, extraordinary beings needed to get extraordinary warm, even for a little bit. Oh? And their lazy eyes weren't working today. Because the wind makes them cry. How would they get around to keep warm? To keep you warm? How would... Yeah! Not that they don't know, of course they do. But they also couldn't help but notice the thick fur and fireplace back there. I see, yes. Well, I would reckon these incredible people would have to first go on a critical mission. A mission? Yes, yes, a mission of great importance. A rescue and recovery mission. A crucial... of crucial assets. They would be willing, no, inclined to go on this mission. Haha, <laughs> yes, of course they would. The secret riches they would be so inclined to fetch are located near the coastline in Whitestone Bay. A box of highly delicate material can be found near the edge or the end of the cliff. Message received. What's in the box? Some rocks. Rocks? Rocks. I see. It is of the utmost importance that this objective is retrieved and delivered to me. And then we can see about warming up this crew. You want some box? I don't have it completed, right? I mean, I went over there, but yeah. Well, good thing we unlocked the boss, the boss stop over there. To find some rocks. It's dark. I have them. I don't know when I picked them up. It doesn't matter. Jax, I got your sauna stones. Even though it's saying that I don't. I guess I had them the entire time. Mission accomplished. Wonderful. These will come in handy. Thank you, my friend. You are a good bear. Ah, shucks. Wait, I don't know how to feel about that one. How come? I thought compliments weren't good for you. Not the hollow ones, perhaps. But you weren't born a good bear. You made yourself into one. The same goes for insults. Well, neither feel like the truth to me. Maybe they didn't come from the truth. Or they didn't stick the landing. Either way, it's you that has to give the green light. Let's see about warming up, shall we? That hot head of yours can only radiate so much warmth. Damn. I don't want to brag, but it is positively steaming. Yes, well, eventually you'll have to burn a couple of logs. Take this and make a little heating room. Yay! I'll show you how to turn it on after. Areas with cold weather would need a utility room to compensate for the low temperatures. Utility rooms need a heater to be functional. Heaters are loud and messy, which messy they carry a negative decoration score. Utility rooms will apply the negative decoration score in an area effect around them. You can see the debuff area by clicking on the room wall in build mode. In order to make heaters function, you will need to add fuel to them. Jeez. If the temperatures drop too low, the heaters will kick in and consume fuel at the rate of one per hour, granting heat. The goal of heating is to never drop below their level their guests requires going over will have no effect. Better heaters will give more heat and have a smaller impact on decoration. Each utility room will heat up an entire building, so resorts with multiple buildings will require multiple utility rooms. All right, we'll fix up this one too. All right, so we got two buildings. 
by the looks of it. And I'm gonna have to put kitchen, dining, and heating in both of them. Okay, let's get to work. Do we need to put this in both of them or just one? Museum furniture. was it? Six? I can only make five at a time. <laughs> I can only make five at a time! And then we'll need at least one bathroom. We'll start with two bedrooms. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, it doesn't even need to be that big. What? Anywho. Where is it? Perfect. Um, yes. <laughs> we should also put the kitchen in, um, kitchen in here, at least. And then the dining room. I have to make that bigger. Like, how big is this? This is pretty big. They won't all fit there. I didn't mean to add a door or a window, but to add door. to put down here now. Wait. Oh, that's the noise. That's the noise it makes. That's the disruption. I was like, what does that mean? <laughs> I'm not too sure about what to do about this because it's so awkward and I don't need this big of a room at least not yet okay we're gonna have to put like a pretty awesome bathroom 
like in the middle here. Um, I guess. That might reach everything I want to do. I want to put like a bedroom here too, but I might have messed that up. Like, do we want to do pretty big bedrooms and make them like the best they could be? <laughs> There's a door. There's a door there. split this into two rooms actually hmm. okay but if we do that then that one doesn't reach unless we get new bed uh, new furniture stuff we have to look out for now. We're back on those skinny hallways, guys. That's all they need, right? <laughs> Honestly, this we could just do like I don't know what I'm doing anymore. We're just we're just falling. Whatever we're doing, we're doing. We have no guest requests. Come on. Don't I have everything I need in there? Alright, let's go tell Jax that we built the utility room. Have you made a home for your heater yet? Yes. This is- then it is only fair that you put it to good use. Let me know if- oh, we gotta put the- Jax, can you just come down to- just come down here so I don't have to walk back up there. There we go. 24C? How do we... What is our rooms at? Huh. I'm beginning to see that we might need two of them. Or do we need to just put more fuel in this one? What if we just put all our fuel? Then what? Hmm. Hold on. Then we might have um, a purpose for... Okay, well, hang on. Huh. I have an idea, but it's going to be a little weird. But we're okay with that. Right? This little closet over here. <laughs> oh my god. It 
It's gonna be so weird. But it's gonna work. <laughs> Who says we need a door going from the inside? No one. Oh, why is that one weird? <laughs> I can't walk in. Let's fix that. There. No one says that we have to have a door from the inside to do that. Well, now we're at 25. Which is exactly what everyone wants. Well, not exactly. I didn't put any food items here yet. We can put cornflakes. We can put the egg dippy. We can put mushroom soup. Oh, we only have we only have nine. Sorry. We have twenty-eight, eighteen, nine. <laughs> Wait, is that because of that? Oh no. Huh. Stop. The little space it has on that room. Fuck. No. Okay, so we need to rethink this. Wait, can we just delete the room? Delete it. Maybe I shouldn't have deleted the, um, that bedroom. Wait, I'm just thinking, do I need to make a, wait, wait. Can I just edit this room to have two of them? I just, let me just. Slot two of those bitches in there. And let's rebuild this damn bedroom that we wanted. Shit. Right, we gotta put wood in the other one. Or fuel, whatever. Hello? Alright, there we go. 
All right, now we're in business. <laughs> now we're in business. These are tough cookies over here. Just saying. It's like hardcore mode. All right, Jax, we did it. What are you doing? How goes the heating adventure? Were you able to nourish the fire? Yes, it was very, oh, no. I was very hungry. Good, you're almost a master of craft now. Quite a cozy craft. Being hospitable. Well, don't be fooled. The fire runs out quickly without a keen eye to watch over it. Make sure you give it plenty of light and water it every day. I know you're joking, but for a second there I was about to go get a bucket. Who said I was joking? Jack's burnables. Oh, he's got a quest. Hey. Well, if it isn't our gracious host, I've been meaning to ask, how did you end up here? Well, like most of our kind here, we often lived in the shadows of humans. Those of us that I had a use for. I was lucky to be large enough that even your kind would have second thoughts about finding that last snack before bed on the ski grounds. That and, of course, my coat being thick enough to survive outside. Others that were brought along were not as fortunate. There's always a fire running in your home, though. And I'm quite certain it will stay that way until the day I lay down for my last nap. That's sad. You can grow a thick skin and a warm coat, but no one deserves to sleep out in the cold all their life. I only oh, that's so sad. His owner made him sleep outside? What the fuck? Don't do that to your animals. If, if you're fucking cold, they're fucking cold. Anyway, sorry. I only need five seconds outside to agree to that. However, when the humans had a reason for celebration, their warmth was extended to all. I remember how we all gathered around the television and watched other humans tell them stories. Like a magical bonfire keeping us all entr entranced. Will, do Will does that too. He makes us watch them with him. He keeps watching after we all doze off and he's still there the next day. Stories are sometimes what we all we have when reality doesn't suit us very well. There's a big ruined building in High Lake. You might have passed it on your way here. An old radio and broadcast station. That's where the stories used to come from. How did a house tell stories? I'm no expert, but it might have had something to do with the giant radio dish on top of it. You might be able to give your guests another chance at those stories. Ooh, we can put TVs in the rooms. If you give the broadcast station the same treatment you give, you gave the ski resort. You have another quest? Nice of you to drop by again. Good to see your tail hasn't fallen off yet. It's holding on for dear life. You mentioned that you had more nuanced reason for jeopardizing your posterior in this coal. Sometime, something piquant, you said? What? Zesty, yeah. A friend asked me to go look for something unfamiliar to cook. Unfamiliar to whom? To my friend. I'm not familiar with what your friend is not familiar with. That word doesn't sound real to me anymore. Which word? I'm not familiar with it. Okay, Jax. I liked you more before the sense of humor came out swinging. Yes, well, some things have a way of thawing out of you in the sauna. But I did say I could help you with your tasty quest in exchange for our little mission. And I'm adamant that your friend hasn't cooked with one of these yet. Behold, a bitter lemon. I knew it was going to be a lemon. I prefer to eat the things that don't hurt my food hole. On the contrary, anything that's worth its weight in salt needs a little contrast. All of the snow would be nothing but glacial misery if not for a little fire. I saved this lemon tree from the old greenhouse down the road. When chaos erupted in the valley, soft green light was not high on the list of protection against harm. Everything was pillaged, pill, pillaged or burnt. But this one sapling survived long enough to be evacuated. In exchange for its life, it offered us its endurance, which I now pass on to you and your friend. I like how Jax talks. I like Jax. And if your friend would need some more zest in the future, tell them a hardened but comical character would be glad to offer it. I'm not familiar with who you're talking about. Ha! So you, there is a funny bone in there somewhere. Thanks, Jax. Alright. Oh. Oh. I want to go up to his lodge because I know there's lemons in there. Just going to get some for myself. And also, he has a shop here. Where we can just buy fuel on fuel if we need to. Alrighty. Well. I guess, um, yeah, we can talk to Finn now. <coughs> Ugh. 
As you know, historians have yet to discover who made the first snowman. Don't drop the snowball go down in history today. Be the first to take advantage of our precious metal package. Hi, I think I'm the master of fire now. <laughs> you deserve only the slowest of claps. Now that you've reached the lower limit of what's required to sustain life in this location, you are required to meet the minimum threshold that will show us your loving parent company. Yes, yes. That you have brought this established to the world-class status our customers expect and deserve. I will do that. Ooh. <laughs> Just give me everything. I don't know what I got, but we got it. <laughs> well, time to reply. I should have waited. Time to replace everything, probably. Oh, wow. But how much, uh... Huh. We didn't get any more kitchen stuff, but we got another set of dining stuff. So we will <laughs> replace that stuff. How big is that? Six. So it holds the same, it's just prettier. Alright, I can only make five at a time. Voila! Perfect! Oh, that's so awesome. Let's uh, put food in this. And that holds so much. So we need to really kick our butts in gear to get ingredients that we can buy and cook <clears throat> for two places now. All right, what else did we get? Bathroom stuff? Yes, yes we did. We got a lavish tub and a sink and a toilet. Wait. <clears throat> I am so happy. Look at this. Put the window right over it. Why not? Wait. There we go. Beautiful. Look how wide that is. Honestly, we could probably move the bathroom down. I wish we could, I wish we could move bathrooms by themselves. Now we can put another bedroom over here. It's gonna be a skinny one, but it'll work, right? Maybe? Maybe we'll just expand that one? I don't know, we'll figure out what we do. It's a weirdly shaped place. Maybe we should just focus on bigger bedrooms. Especially with what we probably just unlocked. We got the divine join, join, Dijon bed. Wonder how big that is. Cute vanity table. That's all we got. Okay, cool. No, that's good. Okay, we'll make two of them. Yeah. Okay. So if we put this up, that's 
pretty big, but it's not like... Well, that's big. Oh, they don't have lights! <laughs> we need to go get lights for everything! Oh, shit. Let's do that. Run. <clears throat> Wait, where's Took? Down here? He just unlocked. Oh my god, that's so cute. Oh, I love this stuff. Stone fireplace. Maybe we should make these like bigger rooms, like really fancy, is what I'm thinking. I really like this cherry blossom tree. Ah! Okay. Wait, I don't even have to walk over there. I love this stuff. So maybe we should make... Oops. Edit. Does that not give you light? <laughs> I feel like it should. Oh, that one's very big. I can't frickin' see, bro. There we go. Oh, we don't need that actually anymore. Nor this. Actually, no, we actually need that one. I don't know what I'm doing. I really like this rug. It's very pretty to me. go. Do we want to add window? Why not? There's no light in these places either. Okay, so we need light from the main room. One, two, three, four. Nope. Create that. I'm so happy we have that tape measure. 
So we're not like... Oh, wait. 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 I thought that was bigger. I thought that was bigger. Try that. So we don't have to keep walking back and forth anymore. That looks so weird. Oh, the bathroom doesn't have one. Fuck. Ah. One of these days we'll figure it out. There, everything has a light now in that place. Alright, we need to go back to Julia and give her the lemon so she can probably give us more recipes so we can go cook for wait i just read this title rat tattoo it <laughs> 